Alright, this is a 52-inch Monte Carlo branded ceiling fan. I got a Habitat Restore, because I'm now a volunteer there. Basically, what I do for them is clean up donated ceiling fans and lighting fixtures. I think this is uh, quite a cool uh, fan I got in particular, though, because I'm uh, going to show you a really cool feature that it has. And that is an ambient upper light kit. This is uh, kind of to give a nice ambient glow. And because the fan does not have a uh, down light, it actually... Uh, Monte Carlo decided to put this in, which is really cool. Uh, it takes 440 watt incandescent light bulbs. I am using clear ones, by the way, because that's all I had. They still seem to work fine, though. Anyway, I'm going to turn that off, and I'm going to demonstrate the fan now. I'll start with high speed. And it is a little bit uh, loud when it first starts up, but it does get quieter once it uh, gets going. And as for RPMs, I'd say high probably goes around maybe 135, basically about average high speed. It does wobble a little bit, but that's okay. Here's a fan running with the ambient light. I think I'll just leave that on. Anyway, here's medium speed. That's probably going to go around 120 RPM. It's also quite a powerful uh, model, so you might be able to hear the wind noise in the camera microphone. Maybe, maybe not. I'm not too sure. Anyway, now for low. And that's probably going to go around uh, probably 55 RPMs, which is nice slow low speed. Anyway, turn it off here. Um, I'm going to talk about the uh, features and also some general information. Features are that it has reversible blades. So this is kind of like a um, kind of like walnut. And then it also has like a maple size of blades. I did choose walnut. Uh, it's not what it originally came with, but I like that a little bit more than maple, to be honest. It's an antique brass finish, which is uh, quite a cool color. I actually like antique brass a lot. And of course, the decorative uplight is a nice touch as well. And it can be down rod or flush mount. However, the uh, current canopy it has uh, actually does not allow it to be a flush mount, so you need to get a separate one if you want to put it on the lower ceiling. Also, uh, allows you to put a down light, but personally, I think it's just, I think it's perfectly good with just this upper light. I'll turn that off, by the way. Now I'm going to talk about some general information. Uh, the fan's wiring was in shambles when I first got it because someone decided to take out all the wiring in here and just leave um, leave the parts in the box the fan came in. Came in like a small box. Um, and that was really confusing, but I did actually end up wiring everything back correctly. And yeah. Also, the fan is a relabeled Westinghouse model. Though Westinghouse never made fans like this, um, that's actually the manufacturer that Monte Carlo chose to um, make their ceiling fans. I believe this one was actually branded Kendall, however I'm just going to call it a Monte Carlo because uh, Kendall wasn't quite as popular as a brand. Plus, uh, Monte Carlo had a wider distribution. Anyway, now I'm going to talk about the pros and cons. I like the fact that it has an uplight, I think that's a cool touch. However, it does not have a cover to protect the light bulbs. I guess you could say that's kind of a con. Um, I like the fact that it gives you the option between maple and walnut blades, so it can suit any decor. I also like the fact that it's an antique brass finish because that's really nice. I believe the model name of this, by the way, is Lightcast because I have a Monte Carlo catalog and that's it looks very similar to that model. Also, the fan did originally come with a remote control, but I took that off because I just like good old-fashioned pull chains, personally. And yeah, now I'm going to talk about some other cons. Is, uh, one of them is that it hums and it also wobbles. I'd have to give this uh, probably 4 out of 5 stars. Good fan, pretty fancy, just uh, does have some minor issues. And also things to be uh, considered like it has no cover for the bulbs. So yeah, anyway guys, thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video and lots more exciting videos to come.